Hello and welcome to the Cowboy for Game Yu-Gi-Oh! podcast. I'm your host Jake. Today I'm joined by Ben from Nolan TCG. Hello. And Kurt from Locals. I'm bad at Yu-Gi-Oh! Yeah, we all are. <laughs> uh, but we'll get into that. Um, how well, let's is... start there. Yeah. Well, no, no, because... no. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Different, yeah. different, so different. You... Yeah. My week in Yu-Gi-Oh! Uh... What happened at Locals on Tuesday night? We oh, we think. Yeah, <laughs> true. We didn't go to Locals on Tuesday night. Thank you. Thanks. Thankfully, I played today, despite the fact that there wasn't many people at Locals because everyone went away to tournaments. Um, I had another commitment to sort out. But uh, yeah, I went today, went X1, lost to Luke in the final, uh, got ripped two out of my hand and was just like, okay. I have ripped, he ripped two in and then ended on like Appaloosa, uh, Baron, and the other one. And the, the Charles. One. Yeah. And like, I can force every negation. I just can't push through the board once that happens. Mm-hmm. And it's like. You just recycle everything? Yeah, with. Well, I think what. I ended up having three cards in hand starting my turn. Two cards in hand? Uh, four cards in hand? I don't know. Anyway, oh yeah, because I used Impulse on his turn. So yeah, I had three cards in my hand to start my turn. And uh, so I could, yeah, force every interaction, but then couldn't break the board. It's like, yeah, it's fine. That's not going to happen, you know. If I could push through that, then I could push through anything. Um, and that was it. I got a glorious $5 store credit, because there was low turnout. <laughs> <laughs> it was great. Um... And yeah, that was the entirety of my week in Yu-Gi-Oh. No Master Duelies? No, I didn't touch it. No? You see, I did the whole thing of uh, Disregard Odo. Completely. There's a new pass, though, with a new mate. And I'll play it when we get close to that pass <laughs> expiring. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it's not... Surely it's not that far from Rescue Ways being in there. Yeah, it was supposed to be last set, but then I skipped it. They were like, too good! Next set. Hmm. I mean, Crossout's only a one in Master Duel, so... Yeah, it's fine. People can't side deck for you. <laughs> yeah, but people main deck all kinds of cooked shit in Master Duel. Ah, it's okay. One-offs, everything. <laughs> you lose to random ass cards? It's okay. Uh, so, that brings us on to mine and Kurt's week. Um, so, wait, you didn't play on Tuesday either, did you? Nah, no, no one went. Yeah, no one went to locals. Just uh, checking. We gave the heads up, you know? True. It was um, also very hot. <laughs> um, so yeah, today Kurt and I and a couple other people from Locals went to uh, Penrith for the OTS Championships. Uh, originally we'd been booked into Alliance, but Alliance was going to have a lot of good players and we decided we'd uh, put the odds in our favour a little bit and go to the store that had theirs announced later and therefore would have less good people going. And how did that go for you, Jake? For me, it went terrible. Um, so <laughs> I went uh, X4 today in the end. I probably could have dropped earlier, but I was like... People Six listed. rounds? Yeah. Uh, you, yeah, I didn't do great. You only lost... Four rounds. We lost really? his last three. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, it was X1 after three, so we lost oh, his last Oh, yeah, three. you lost your first, and then you were on the bridge of winning every game. Yeah, 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 yeah. So, um, mm-hmm. for the most part, I lost to some bad hands. Um, I was in a situation today where I kept drawing at least, like, I'd say in each of my games or each of my rounds rather in one game i drew at least one if not both of the two that do fuck all in hand both yeah both mm-hmm. uh so they did nothing um i also was in a situation a few times where i'd either draw no prosp like combo but no prosp or two to three prosp in the one hand maybe your issue is playing prosp <laughs> well that's the thing mm-hmm. when i had it in my hand it was great <laughs> Because you do your thing, then you prosp, or you're not sure what your thing's going to be. You prosp a little, see what you can get, and be like, okay, this is now my line. So I like prosp. I refuse to pay the money that people are asking for them now, but I like prosp. I had a funny thing happen today when... So I've changed my build up slightly, where I'm now playing two prosp, two small world. Uh Small world, uh, you can activate once per turn. And Luke knew I had the kaiju in my deck. (laughs) So uh, I was like, activate small world. He's like, negate activation. I'm like, activate small world. He negates with the Baron. And I was like, good thing I opened both my small worlds. 
now I continue to combo. Um, yeah, and then a couple of interactions I lost um, purely because I just didn't think. The main one was I was versing Drytron in, I think it was the fourth round, um, and he set up his thing and then whacked down deck lockdown. Um, oh, yeah. So two things about that. Um, well, main one thing, really. Uh, I didn't realise it also stopped you summoning from deck. I assumed mm. it was just the search. So I was like, oh, okay, yeah, normal tool guide. And I was like, yeah, try to use effect. He's like, no. <laughs> I was like, eh. But this all could have been avoided if I'd done the thing that I've told myself to do so many times when it comes to games two and three, when I signed in Nibiru because I Nibiru'd him. You, you um, didn't put it in a I didn't put it in a yeah. token. Oh. And if I'd just <laughs> crashed into the token and then dropped the evenly that I had in my hand, deck lockdown wouldn't have been a problem. Unless he kept the deck Unless lockdown. Unless he kept it, yeah. You can't when you have a token. Oh, oh yeah, yeah true. true. Yeah, why are you doing that? Why are you doing that? You did what I, I did. Why are you doing that, I foregore. See, the issue is as well that I haven't played this variant of the deck for very long. I literally picked up the pieces, oh, like I played oh, a Thursday did. locals with it, and like it was a two round thing, hmm. and other matchups mattered. And even then, I changed it from that to other stuff. So like it's very new to me. So I'm still learning the lines and the best interactions. And because of that, I'm distracted on the simple shit of leave the Nibiru token in attack mode. Um, but yeah, like it was a learning experience. It's still super early in the season as well. Mm -hmm. So there's plenty of opportunity for me to get an invite later down the line. I just feel a little bit sheepish for the missteps that I made that maybe could have got me to game. Also, the, the OTS championships only having four invites despite the fact that a little bit cringe you end up like you end up with 60 fucking players at probably both alliance yes. and penrith today yes it's like maybe maybe we give out like four per like one per four entries yeah the fact there's no scaling it's just if the store wishes to have a hundred you're still just getting four yeah mm. like i'd rather just wait for the regional season and That's commit the to that issue with orange because what? they have a soft cap of 64. But oh, isn't that fine. an actual regional? It's an actual regional, yeah. Yeah, yeah, but... Oh, so we'll get... If, it's it's like 100, if you get like... 50 billion, you'll get more invites. Oh, okay. I, that's my bad. Then, yeah. I think it's still eight. I think there is a point where you can it's, get to more, but I think like in Australia, it's pretty much impossible. Yeah, it's, it's 126, and then you get 16 invites. Okay. But that's not going to happen because it's in regional New South Wales. Yeah. Like super regional New it's, South Wales. It's one invite to eight after you go past 64 or something like that. I don't know. Okay. Anywho. Um, yeah. So learning experience, if nothing else today, yeah. and fun trip with Da Boys. Um, Kurt, how was yours? God awful. <laughs> uh, game, well, I, I went with Sword Soul because... It was the same place where I got my invite uh, for Brisbane a couple of months ago. So I was like, I'll bring the same deck. But in that instance, there was 32 invites. Yeah, <laughs> that is the true. that there was today. Um, game one, I versed Dragon Link and round one, uh, round one, game one, I Baron passed with two books. Baron gets impermed. I'm like, okay, well, this is over. Round two, pretty much the same. Baron pass. I have seven non-engine cards. Can you not... And I bricked on them. I'm not sure if this is legal, but can you not just, like, Baron negate something after it's been impermed and then book it? It's still under the effects of imperm. So even if it gets flipped down, because imperm has already Resolved placed its effect entirely. and resolved. Okay. Okay, sure. Yeah, like... It, I don't. I was just bad luck there. Uh, he ended up winning game three because of game two. Just kept on going. Baron pass. Baron pass. Baron pass. Yeah. Beat down. Yeah. Game three. Good hand. Needed emergence. Got emergence. Fragrance. Game over. <laughs> so he lost. Lost round one. So what I'm hearing is you don't play enough quick play engine searches. Oh yeah, all those quick play searches for Sword Soul. Sword Soul, there's not. <laughs> um, there's, there's the uh, Dragon Souls one. That's like add and then tribute one. 
Yeah, but you need to have a monster on board. Yeah, it tributes a monster on the board, so he doesn't have、oh, a quick summon、fine. worm. <laughs> summon quick, something. A, a worm that summons、um, as cost to then quick play tribute it to search. <laughs> Game two, reverse cash. That deck can go. It is. It is. In just tomorrow, several hours. I, well, the thing is, I oh wait, no. By the time you're listening, it's already dead. That's true. There's also an OCG ban list. By the time you're listening to this, people.、Oh, I can't believe they banned Rescue Ace. <laughs> <laughs> people who、I、are、will. going to be on Copium of Cash, I'm going to hate them even more. Yeah, it's be- going to it's going to become a blind second deck.、It's- no, no, no. It's going to become. I'm playing 15 floodgates with all my monsters. That well, it's one of the two, right? Like it already had a pretty decent OTK under four summons, so it's just going to be either I'm going to play like a bunch of board breakers and then summon a bunch of cash and then kill you, or I'm going to summon a bunch of cash and then just floodgate the fuck out of you. Yeah.、Uh, cash player two owed me game one. He shifted Ash nibbed. Yeah. Game two, he nid me, so I then just passed on Chi Chao because I ended up being having the tennies to keep going. And then following turn, I was able to stop him. My turn, go off, nibbed again. I'm like, okay, done. I'm X two at this point. I'm like, okay, I will just. Oh, funny thing is, first game round table twenty six, round two table twenty six. Round three, table twenty six. <laughs> I sat in the same chair all three times. <laughs> Only up from here, sword soul mirror match, and I lose it. I I played my I don't know what went wrong. I don't like sword soul. I don't like the game. <laughs> the game Welcome to you. The game sucks. <laughs> no, I think the game's great right now. Because I'm winning. It has to be said though, and I think I've said this before. You have a very nostalgic mindset when it comes to this game. Like you put a lot of emphasis on things you've done before, and you continue to go back to them. Which is strange for someone that's only been playing competitively for like a year and a half. Yeah. yeah. Like when it comes to events, you tend to only play decks that you've done well with in the past. It's time to branch out. It's time to do some new stuff. I can see it ticking over his head right now. He's like, "But if I play tier, <laughs> he's tossing up between <laughs> tier and、uh, for high runic sprite next week." Ah,、uh, that's okay. That's okay. It's orange. So the... you get some random shit in orange. So you got to be ready to cover off on that. So the thing I'm going to say in advance of your next.、Uh, Like next deck choices. Well, not even next weekend. Just whatever you do moving forward. Branch out. Do the main thing I want to say though is play tier. Do not play tier in decks that involve the graveyard. I know you want to play it in Horus. It's not good in Horus. Please don't play tier. Do not. Yeah. Why is it bad in tier? Because in it、Horus. doesn't do the thing you think it does. It mills. Hmm. Not the way you want it to. Ah,、oh, it's fun. Yeah, it's not. Yeah, it's fun. It's you、good. get zombie vampire.、Yeah. You get grass. If you're depending on zombie vi- vampire to do your thing, you've already lost. Nah, I want. I want. Um. If you're relying on Horus to do your thing. Chaos ruler back. Horus is fine if you play it properly.、Mm. Runic Horus. Let's not look at OCG recaps. <laughs> How many times have we said on this podcast you cannot use the OCG to dictate what happens in the TCG? No, no. But that's if something's good. If something's the same bad, thing can be said for something bad. Name like, a bad deck that's good in the OCG. Fucking one. Name like、no. maybe get as bad in the OCG as good in TCG. Unchained. Oh damn! You said it. I don't think you would. Of course I did. Are you kidding? You was... shat on that deck all the time. It was in the OCG. Yeah. And here it's T one. I've lost to it once. You haven't versed a competent player yet. Said the thing. I'm, 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 I'm super I'm not, worried that I'm going to、yeah, come up against a good. good unchained player in orange and just get <laughs> fucking destroyed. So as I said, I've only just got a competent list together. So you've been versing pure unchained for quite a while, and you've gotten too comfortable. Yeah,、so、it、I、upsets me. I hope you、me. get fucking dunked on. I'm going to blame you. Good, do that. Suffering for success. Don't give a fuck. <laughs> <laughs> It's all Jake's fault. 
We don't get good testing in because Jake plays suboptimal lists. Well, yeah. the list is fixed now, so Tuesday you'll have a chance, Jake, assuming that we verse, because Jake, we will. <laughs> Jake puts his be, decks together and goes, Jake but I like this. <laughs> <laughs> that is that is pretty much what I do, yeah. I can never beat Jake because he doesn't play the optimal. Yeah, he plays random. That speaks <laughs> poorly <laughs> to you. You hold your him, hand traps for no, the disruption. I, I know he the action the line. Him, him <laughs> whinging that I'm not playing a good list and he always wins is very different to you saying that I play a bad list and you'd lose to it. <laughs> that <laughs> reflects poorly on you and not on me, sir. The awkward thing is, I said good day. <laughs> Remember when I said that Jake hadn't been yelling for the past few weeks, so it didn't pop his mind? <laughs> now I'm under attack! <laughs> settle, settle. The best defense is offense. I apologize to the listeners for uh, the mic pops that just occurred. I don't. You knew what you you knew what this was. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, let's get into some news, of which there's not a lot. Um, oh, that's okay. There's so, going to be a ban list. I mean, for the OCG. Yeah. But not today. In two hours. Sorry. Actually, actually in two hours? Yeah, it drops at 10 o'clock. Oh, really? Yep. Oh, Why didn't we, we should have waited. Two hours ago then. Because then I don't get this edited until no. like one in the morning and I have work tomorrow. Oh, uh, yeah, fair. I kind of want to go home. <laughs> uh, so, anyway, um, in Master Duel, currently, we are into the uh, Fusion and Xyz Festival. Um, ben, I know you're not playing. Kurt, I know you're not playing. Um, what I decided to play uh, was. Spriggan's Time Thief. You told me about this. I did. I gave you the credit of thinking you were playing this in the actual ladder, and I was like, what oh, is absolutely. wrong with him? No, 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 I've been able to build about half the boards that it has shown me, but that has been enough. Yeah. Most people look at the fact that things are happening, and because it's Master Duel and the time versus gem equivalent's not there to be like, oh, I wonder if he'll fuck up this play. Uh, it just isn't there. So by about the sixth or seventh summon of a random Spriggans or Time Thief or whatever, they just go, nah, I'm done. Yeah, bye. I'm out. I will work it out at some point. I really should because I crafted a lot of URs for that deck. Yeah, that's Actually, fine. no, sorry. Not a lot of URs. It was just the extra deck URs. Like, the main deck had three. Like, like, C-Max, C-Max, C-Max. Extra deck <laughs> I'm assuming you're playing, like, Therian King Regulus and shit, though, yeah? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. And that's all, that, that Therian King Regulus line is probably UR, UR. In the extra deck. Well, no. Well, yeah, Sartorius it probably and... is, but I already had um, Champion Sagas from PAX in Royal Rare, and that was part of the reason why I decided Royal to... Royal Rare? <laughs> he even flourished his hand. He's like, in Royal Rare? Well, yeah, it searches the king. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> Don't you have Actually, most of the time... in Royal Rare? I do have Rikalos yeah. in Royal Rare. Yeah. More royalty. <laughs> More royalty. And Terrellman Scream. I tried to get Kikalos, but it just wasn't happening for me. <laughs> um, so yeah, I was playing that, having fun. I was pretty much like right at the end of it, and as I was like collecting some gems, I noticed that it has a like gem reward uh, thing for the number of fusion monsters you make, but not for Xyz. And I was like, well, I'm just leaving gems on the table at this point. So I pivoted, and I'm now playing uh, Branded. Because I had that ready. I was going to say, you would have already had that built. Well, I had, just play most, that from the start? I had <laughs> most of the new stuff. Well, that's the thing. I just I like to play different decks. I know you don't understand this concept, but okay. on Master Duel, I like variety. Mm. Also, you have fluff in your hair. Yeah, I've had fluff in my hair like in Rena Swartz all day. Um, but yeah, I, I like... I your hair is a whole other story. Uh, so... Um, he wasn't talking about that. I he wasn't, wasn't talking, talking about, about his deck choices in I, I, I don't like. I like playing the same deck. Yeah, that's been demonstrated. We literally talked and about Kurt it. Kurt just has frustrated game. Yu-Gi-Oh player What's here. What's my hair? It's very all over the place. From you'd be, clearly been sitting here all day, like, <laughs> 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 why are my combos not resolving? <laughs> <laughs> why do they keep in burning Mo Yi? That's just the hat. Um. Yeah, so I've pivoted over to that. The first couple of duels, I um, didn't realise I wasn't playing with, like, oh, Cartesia fine. and shit like that. <laughs> but I still won them. Uh, but now I am playing Cartesia and everything's fine. Um, 
Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Um, but in order to celebrate the uh, release of the festival, they also released the Ninja Starter Deck. Ah, oh, yay. Because they have fusions. Why do they release Starter Decks for like every random deck? That they I do Black Wing. choose really random archetypes to make structure decks for. They all like seem the to... spell books and the dragon maids. And... Yeah. yeah they all seem to be things that I play though. <laughs> yeah, a little bit. Actually, yeah. Maybe Jerome's I mean, doing it. You think you can suck up to me, Jerome? <laughs> you were looking for any excuse to bring up Jerome. You're like, it's been 15 minutes. I haven't called out Jerome. Kiss us. <laughs> <laughs> uh, but in addition to that, we also have a new mate in uh, Ninja Grim and Master Hanzo. Yes. He looks cool. He does a thing. Yeah, we knew this last week, but you didn't want to talk about it. No, we didn't. Uh, but we also have uh, the... No, did I announce this last week? I think I did. Um, but the uh, reward for the Xyz and Fusion Festival is a Grave and Banished Surround of uh, Predator Plant Chimera Reflesia. I have a picture of it here. It is haunting. Um, I don't even know what that card is. Uh, yeah. Predator you know Plant what? Chimera. Chimera Reflesia. You Tra- know what Trix it is. Reflesia? No. It's Pred- like Predator Plant Chimera Pred- Reflesia. Chimera and Trap Trick combined. Yes. That's why I'm it's a fusion. Sh- I'm sure there's a picture of it here somewhere, but it's a fact. Is it a three headed, like, big? That's true. No, yeah, okay. So I don't know what this is. It's in here somewhere. Uh, I'll find out later when I care. Ah, there it is. That one. Oh, okay. It's the plant one. Yeah, I really don't like looking at it. It scares me. Um, I'm not about it. Oh, but it's cool. It's there if people want it. I like it. Um, the lone decks ah. for it were uh, Lunar Light, uh, the Wondrous Wings of Nightmare, Raid Raptors, uh, and some Pendulum Nonsense. Name the name for Pendulum Nonsense. You name the name for Raid Raptors, say the Pendulum name. Beautiful and Indomitable Eyes. There you go. For those that were curious at home. Oh, no, I didn't say the uh, Lunar Light one. Dancing King of Beasts. Ah, oh, I thought it was going to say fuckable. <laughs> 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 he's been away from his dragons too long he's just gone back to standard furry instead of a scaly uh, moving on from that because frankly <laughs> bleh, um, in the OCG there's many things happening Strom's favourite what? nothing uh, so in the Isn't OCG, bad. they have a, they're calling it satellite shop, but I'm assuming it's like pop-up shop. Yeah. 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 Um, that has some they, custom they tokens. They really like those. What have they got? Uh, well, I'm about to read them out for you. <laughs> there is, When's the satellite uh, shop it's, it's, running? Two uh, correspondence in Japan right now. I don't know if there's a date. There's two actual tokens that make sense. Yeah, are they... The tokens are all uh, like random. Yeah, the artwork for them, there's Golden very few Lord. that act. Why? Let, let me get into a shop. I'm sorry. Um, so you've got Caesar Valius <laughs> from Vanquish Soul. You've got uh, Witchcrafter Madame Ver. You've got Eldritch Garden Lord, but not Sassy Lord, which angers me. Um, <laughs> you've got House Dragon Maid. You've got uh, the Evil Twin Lesbians. Uh, you've got Ohime Manifested Makonko. You've got uh, Yoko the Graceful by Akashi. Uh, do, do Sulfur called Coolia. Lovely Lady Labyrinth of the Silver Castle. Raphael, champion for high. <laughs> right of Aramis here. Tick, needs Tick. a token. Perfect, great. Uh, and the Weather Painter Rainbow. Only You're right, none of that makes sense. Only of makes one of these decks sense. needs a token within the artwork. Where's the Sword Soul token? <laughs> <laughs> they're really random yeah. choices really yeah. random I appreciate that they've like made the effort for the Osuju Swords but Swords it'd be nice if they were when are the shops running Jake? there's no date oh, maybe they're open now I don't know sure at Konami satellite shops throughout Japan stores are giving out yeah there's no date on this at all so I'm I can't inform your person over there uh, when he can get them because he probably okay. can't. And you also, to hook up on the, uh, you'd only want the pearly um, sleeves today, so pearly sleeves incoming. Also, you'd only want the house dragon maiden, even then, why would you want it? 
Yeah, exactly. If these were actually good tokens, I would be like, hey, can you get this for me? Exactly. Like, no. they're so random. But again, I appreciate that they've at least put an effort in. Um, but uh, coming back to the TCG, we have a new side set being announced, uh, Maze of Millennia. We're out of the Maze of Mystery. Or what, what was it called? Memories. Memories, that's why. Uh, yes. I don't like that this is probably replacing our Dragon's Eleven. I mean, time frame for it, it's already past that. It's just falling into like the... Um, oh, yeah, this has replaced our March reprint set. Well, when's the release for it? Have they got an announcement mm, we're for the Battle of Islands? We're getting a Battle of Legends collection. Uh, so this one's coming out in January 2024. Okay. Interesting. Weird that they've announced stuff that comes after this months ago. Hmm. But anyway, uh, as for things that are in it, um, it's a lot of the stuff that was announced in the Anime Chronicles, as far as I can work out. So you've yeah, got yeah. the well, Eye of Illusion, like which time. is weird, yeah. random um, illusion support no one cares about. Uh, the new Dark World Fusion, yep. which is kind of bonkers. Uh, the Bonfire Search spells in there, though. Yeah. Just to break it up and make us spend more money, you know, as it is. Search Pyro Monsters. Hmm. Uh, that... Um, synchro and fusion Dragon archetype, the Earthbounds. That's going to be in here. Okay. I'm looking forward to that because it can do some kind of bonkers stuff. Um, that rank eight that like equips stuff from the opponent's extra deck. The infection buzz king. Okay. Um, transaction rollback. That's the um, kind of this, like pay half your life points and copy a trap effect in the graveyard. Not particularly great, but. There will be players that use it. Hmm. Those um, players will be playing Dynamorphia. More than likely. Um, so, at the moment, the breakdown seems to be 11 Ultras, 16 Supers, and 57 Rares, and a Quarter Century Secret Rare, and 16 of the cards in the set will also be available as Collector's Rares. So, just one QCR in the set. One Quartzy. Yeah, one Quartzy Rares. So um, one Foil problems. card per pack. And then six rares, so seven cards in total. Yeah, it's just uh, the standard rare set. Yep. Did I hate you, those sets. Did you say that Warrior Warrior was going to use old art? I didn't, because nothing that I read indicated as such. Something Kurt read indicated as such. Do your job, Jake. I'm it's doing It's supposed my to job. be the news man here. It doesn't have Here's it on, Kurt breaking the news. It doesn't have it on my fucking thing! Old art junk warrior. Come on there, we're sitting near you. Hmm. Um, kind of nice, actually. That's normal. I was going to say, that's the... That is the standard art. <laughs> uh, I don't like that art. No, no. The background to monster ratio is off. And he's doing that a weird star pose. I actually also think that's the art for another card. No, yeah. it, is, it, is, it is. It is the... It's the that's also, that art is that, also on Synchronize, I think. Yeah. Oh, uh, okay, sure. Wait, that's um, Going back over to the OCG, they have the World Premiere Pack coming out in a little while. Um, I think we announced last week that they're getting all of the stuff that was in our tins like rushed out, the three new exclusive cards. Yeah, that's what happens. None of them are particularly impactful, so it's not that important. They did this last time when they were particularly impactful, and we got our world exclusive Nibiru. And they True. were like, exclusive for two weeks, here you go. <laughs> <laughs> It's mine, give it to me. Uh, but in their World Premiere Pack this year, as a quarter century rare, they're getting the Dark Magician Girl in the TCG and Korean artwork, which is like the sort of neon love heart. Um, the censored artwork. Is it censored? Oh, well, I mean, it's always censored with DMG, let's be real. Um, but yeah, they're getting that as a quarter century rare. If we got anything like that, uh, the weebs would lose their mind. We haven't actually got one yet. Which surprised me. Like this. They're holding on to it, Jake. They're going to slip it into a set and people are going to lose their minds. It's true. They will. Um, and then we have the announcement of the next main set. Uh, this is Legacy of Destruction scheduled for release in the OCG on January 27th. Um, no details really at this stage. They're saying there's new and existing themes. Um, standard sort of nonsense. Uh, they're still doing the quarter century rares. Uh, over there at that point. What if we're just doing quarter century rares forever? forever. Mm. Makes them a little less special if the 25th anniversary runs for another seven years. They'll run for another 25 years and they'll be like, oh, 50th, now it's, uh, 50th anniversary rarezies. <laughs> what would they go? They wouldn't go back to Starlight, would they? Hopefully. I would want them to, but hopefully they do. 
the th one thing they could do is gauge the interest of the rarity collection see what people are liking from that so whether they do just stick with starlight rares or they switch over to prismatic starlight layers i don't rares, like or the new those. ultra rare. you haven't seen them yet so shut up um they're but, the same they, they literally said in the press release they're doing the japanese ones yeah and but, i don't like them but even then our secrets and america's secrets look different our ulties yeah. and their ulties look different even they're so just, the same as the just, japanese just, ones <laughs> there's just <laughs> too much just wait until you see what they look like you may okay like okay them. okay I'm going to pull one, it's going to look the same, and I'm going to throw it at you. Good, <laughs> and I'll take it. <laughs> okay. I really need my system I'm to sort out tax, actually, so I can think of buying a case, which I've wanted to do since they announced it. Imagine not just doing your own tax. Well, she used to work for the ATO. She can do all the loopy holy things. For legal reasons, that's a joke. Um, not much else in the way of news, but... Um, I suppose we didn't really break down uh, YCS Cancun much, did we? Uh, but Unchain lost. It did. Rescue Ace made the final and lost to Flandries. <laughs> I don't get how. <laughs> but who knows? It wasn't streamed, so. Yeah, um, I didn't really have time to it read wasn't the even novel blogged. of the coverage. I swear there was written coverage, wasn't there? No, nah, I asked someone to provide me with a blog and they were like, nah, not blogged. And I was like, damn, I wanted to read a blog in 2023. <laughs> <laughs> the one time I've wanted to read a blog this century. Fucking blogs. It Fuck is... you, Jerome. <laughs> Stream it. <laughs> it is a bit shit. Like, you have so much ability to do it, you just go, oh, it's too hard. No one's going to watch it because of the time difference and being. Just well... fucking do it. The time difference doesn't really mean anything because... Well, their justification is that not as many people will be watching as if it was in the US or the UK. That, yeah, but... But realistically, it's just it's too Mexico. hard basket. Yeah, I know. It's they're the just, same time zone as North this, America. <laughs> they're just saying that their usual justification is that it's too hard. No, I mean, no, the time difference is wrong. Not enough but good it's just I would like difficult. to argue that it's because they don't know how to smuggle things across the border. YCS Niagara? Sorry, can't figure out how to get stuff across the border. This one? Sorry, can't figure out how to get stuff across the border. True. It's the Americans. Personally, I blame Trump. He built walls on either side of America, and now Konami tech people get to the border and they're like, I just can't get it over this wall. Damn. <laughs> Couldn't possibly just take it through customs. No, you don't take things through customs into Mexico. No, no, you don't take things through customs out of Mexico. <laughs> True. Um, yeah. I wish to apologise to all of our Mexican viewers. We understand that you aren't complete smugglers in many way. Uh, it's no, 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 just said that. We're implying that the uh, people that work for Konami are. <laughs> and Jerome. And you, Jerome! <laughs> <laughs> He's saying sorry to Jerome. I mean, I'm not apologizing to Jerome. He was apologizing to the Mexicans. Oh, sure. Yes, not to Jerome. <laughs> it's Jerome's fault. Uh, moving on to question for this week. Um, oh, damn. Short podcast. Yeah, yeah very yeah. short podcast this week. Ask us some more questions, please. Um, but if you weren't aware, Discord will be in the link below. Feel free to jump in, say hi, and ask us questions. Uh, our question this week comes to us from Jesse. Uh, will Danger Orcus ever be good again? It could be. If they just gave us back up. Whose fault's that? Jerome! <laughs> <laughs> you bitch! <laughs> you didn't need to yell it that loud. But yes. I want him to hear me. Because <laughs> he will have heard your abuse, walked away from the, I don't know, <laughs> like computer. massive fat TV that he has from the 1980s because he's too <laughs> cheap ass to buy a flat screen. I can imagine Jerome just like chilling with his old fashioned tech, just being like, but I like this. <laughs> These people are abusing me, I'm gonna go change the channel. Has to get up and flip the dial. <laughs> <laughs> uh, okay, so a couple things with this question, because I feel like it's directed at me. It is. Um, so, Harp doesn't necessarily need to come off the list, it can work without it, but it just makes things a fuck ton easier it's not hurting anyone just give us a one like it's fine no one will die if heart comes back to one is harp searchable 
Yes. I mean, and it's... you can summon it. You can yeah. dump it. Bring it to one. You can do whatever you want with it. Test it. You can loop it. Yeah, like if you're going to bring back Dryden, bring back Harp for fuck's sake. Yeah, also they banned Dryden. Kit. <laughs> yeah, and that's fine. They brought it back, they realised it was a mistake, and then they banned it again. That's all I'm asking for. If Harp becomes a problem... They also hit Barrage, didn't they? Yes. Okay. I yeah. always forget that they did Barrage as well. They hit Red Lotus, brought it back, did, sent it again. Red Lotus. A pointer. Oh, a pointer. Yeah, yeah. a pointer. Did they bring it back? Yeah, they brought oh. it back. I played it for... Oh, it was ages ago they brought it back. Oh, I never realised that. Are you sure? No, hang on, no, no. It, it, was wasn't, it was never hit on the list. It was just super hard to get. And it, like it was a bit yeah, of an no obscure one, like, tech ever card. played it. And then it just ah. became a thing of like, oh yeah, it's super important that I know exactly what my opponent's going to do. I'm going to pay 2,000 life points just to, have, to have a peaky okay. peaky. I thought it was banned. Nah. No, no, no. Oh, no just, it just only ever had one print and there were formats where people would just start playing it and everyone was like, yeah, that's really annoying. good. That's great, but I can't get this card. <laughs> and then it got reprinted in Mavens, right? Dude, they reprinted it like three times. Yeah. yeah, it was an OTS Super. It was in... Ma- was it in Mavens? I printed it into the ground and then they banned it. Yeah. Or standard. It, standard or they did. it was in one of those. Except for a Rise Heart. Uh-huh. Um, <laughs> 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 um, so yeah, give us back Harp. If it's a problem, ban it. Um, secondly, I will be working once uh, Age of Overlord comes out on a new list. It's not strictly Orcus at the moment, but I may make it Orcus. Uh, the Snack Knights. Snack Knights. Okay, so I'm just going to play Shifter? Okay. Snake, snake, I mean, snake, you can. Snake. The Mech Knights don't care about Shifter. Yeah, but the stuff that's going into the graveyard does. <laughs> that's fine. It is okay. Shifter, shoot. Man up. Mm. But here we are. Banless going into effect tomorrow, and it's not. Yeah, the, the banless sucks. Oh yeah. Side note: Can people in groups of like the duelist pages stop talking about a ban list for decks when there's about to be a ban list put into effect? Yeah. We're another two and a half months away from whinging about ban lists. Shut the fuck up. Get it's really program. annoying. So annoying. You're not getting your deck ban list for a while. No, well, my deck, that's the thing. My deck is going to fall off the radar by the time the new set comes out. Yeah, everyone's side's super... Oh, it's ridiculous. Today, so many side cards for just Deck lockdown. Deck. Yeah, that kind of fucked me. But as I said, if I'd done the thing deck that I've told myself... both players? Yes. And it has a maintenance cost, doesn't it? It's not a maintenance cost. It's like during the second standby phase of your thing that it's active, it, it falls away. Up. Okay. Okay. So it's effective for your opponent's turn, then back for your turn, and it goes. Yes. Okay, sure. And the thing about it, like, it doesn't have one of those things where it's like you have to play it at, like, the start of your main phase, so you can just Combo vomit off. out your board and then Start. go, oh, no more searches, now. <laughs> yeah. I feel like that would also probably hurt Rescue Ace. Like, of course it would hurt Rescue Ace because you can't fucking search, but... And you can't summon from the deck. You can't set from deck. But I don't think there's a way to actually get there. I was going to say, you'd have to have opened absolutely perfectly. You'd have to open, like, the Reborn spell, Turb, and the Link 1. And the level 1. And even then, like, one of the cards you're setting from deck is useless. Yeah. There we are. Anywho. um, So, yeah. Once Age of Overlord comes out, I will work on some funny business. Hopefully, uh, we see a profile of it. We'll see how we go. Um, but yeah, that pretty much concludes us for this evening. Uh, if you are watching us on YouTube, feel free to subscribe. If you are watching on Discord, um, Bragg has asked if you could give us five-star reviews uh, or favorite us. Either one is very helpful. Uh, jump into our Discord, ask us some questions for next week, and we will catch you all then. Peace. Bye. Oh, before bye. Um, these guys are going to be in Orange this coming Saturday for the regional, uh, so feel free to uh, go say hi, uh, ask Ben for an autograph. Um, an autograph? Autograph. Tell me to play a different deck. Yeah, tell, t- tell, tell Kurt where he can play. Yeah, actually Comment. Put, it, put it in the Discord. Um, no, I did one before. Do you want a panic? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Catches. <laughs> Tell me what the fuck. Bye.